Prepare to be amazed as we dive deep into the revolutionary design of SpaceX's Crew Dragon capsule and uncover why it's the top choice for astronauts. From comfort to reliability, discover what sets Crew Dragon apart from Soyuz and Starliner and hear firsthand from astronauts about their exhilarating experiences aboard this cutting-edge spacecraft. Join us on SpaceX Flight as we explore the remarkable features of Crew Dragon, including its sleek design, advanced touchscreen controls, and unparalleled autonomy. Learn how SpaceX's dedication to innovation has transformed space travel, making every journey to orbit a smooth and unforgettable experience for astronauts. Make sure to like and subscribe, and hit the bell, so you don't miss another awesome episode, now let's dive right in. The Dragon Space Capsule, is the only capsule capable of carrying NASA astronauts to the ISS, which is important for research and maintenance endeavors. Dragon has successfully launched 42 astronauts, 28 of which are NASA astronauts and more on private missions, on 11 total crew missions, making them the only private company capable of such a feat. Backing up incredible statistics with astronaut testimonies, JAXA astronaut Soichi Noguchi, one of the most experienced astronaut who was on board three space missions, one on the space shuttle, another on Soyuz, and the last on Crew Dragon, and his favorite? He exclaimed, The Dragon's the best I feel Dragon's really ready to go up it's really fun to ride and two days in Dragon is really remarkable memories. Unveiled at a SpaceX event at their headquarters, Dragon outperforms the Soyuz in pretty much every single way, from interior volume being much more spacious, to being capable of carrying more than twice that of Soyuz, to being a reliable, reusable spacecraft. A SpaceX engineer has stated he wants Crew Dragon to feel like a 21st century ship, by adding touchscreen panels to enhance user experience, is stark contrast to the Apollo capsules, which have thousands of switches, buttons making the control panel all cluttered. As Doug Hurley, the commander of the first crewed SpaceX mission which launched in May of 2020 said, you have an overall systems page on the screen and then you can drill down into individual pages as well there's a total of 25 to 30 individual pages and SpaceX may have added more since my last flight with any aircraft or spacecraft you always iterate because it makes sense and it's easy and it'll help the crew. Crew Dragon flies completely autonomously, usually requiring no human intervention, if that fails, they have SpaceX's skilled ground control as a backup, and if that is not enough, they can manually take over. It has a host of safety features, such as a launch abort system, which blasts the capsule away from the rocket should something go awry. Another Crew-1 member NASA astronaut Victor Glover also shared a few words about his experience on Crew Dragon, it was awesome Dragon performed superbly, he added, once the stage was cut off and you're floating I've been able to feel that for a few seconds but to have it for an extended period was truly amazing. When it's time to go home the capsule undocks from the station and preforms a deorbit burn, coming home with a fiery re-entry, and parachuting down to off the coast of Florida. Shane Kimbrough commander of the Crew-2 mission described a pure acceleration of the launch to the space station in an interview, so we're sitting on the launch pad obviously and when the engines lit we all started laughing just because it felt so awesome and powerful. Shortly after that we started accelerating, heading uphill. It was a great ride very smooth. I don't remember any surprises except we were just all happy. We were all pretty excited to be orbit again and feel that incredible acceleration. Kajel Lindgren, the NASA commander of the spacecraft right after landing said, SpaceX from Freedom thank you for an incredible ride up to orbit and an incredible ride home. That's all for today's amazing episode we hope you enjoyed it and learned something new please let us know what you think in the comments section below your feedback is very important to us and helps us make better videos for you thanks so much for watching and we'll see you next time.